What is up, Forts fans? My name is Synergy. You are watching Synergy Gaming TV, and today we are going to be talking about building a basic vanilla base. Lots of you guys have been reaching out uh, asking, hey, can you teach us how to build a base? So, okay. Step number one, a mine. Step number two, technology. Step number three, build a single turbine. Unless you are pinch fist, then you build two. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen, that is how you build a vanilla base. <laughs> Not quite. So, this is basically where we're just uh, against a bot here, a hard, hard bot. Uh, and this is basically where we chill. This is where the where the new players make the biggest mistake. Don't build across the bottom and build this giant base. You build nothing, nothing, other than this little bit that I'm going to show you. Make these three long. So you bring it out and up, and then down. Make a triangle like this. And then we sit and you wait and you do nothing. You wait. Now at this point this is where you should be scouting. Okay, we still have, we've got a door here. So maybe the gunner is still there. This is going to be probably an encampment for maybe a flak or a rocket. Could be um, nothing going on there. Keep an eye on the resources. This construction's finishing up. Look at that. As soon as it's finished, I've got the resources to place down my tier two tech. Now we wall it. Make the base look nice and good. <clears throat> then you add in your next mine, fourth mine, after your tier two tech, fourth mine comes into play. There we go, gunner fired out of that door, so the, the AI kept the gunner. Next, we've got the fourth mine down, we're gonna get another turbine. Now we wanna make a spot for our weapon. So we're gonna do a cannon here. Now this is like the only time that you wanna add something in front of your base. See how I'm just pulling these out one? Then I go halfway up. I've seen so many people try and do these sandbag protection things and they do it wrong. Halfway up. That's So it's nice to... You see why I pulled up these ones first, right? So you just pull them up to the max. And then you go halfway, halfway, connect them. And this is where you're going to put your sandbags. Like that. Now you see how the base is leaning forward? This is where new players want to use ropes. Don't use ropes. Use counterweight. Add some extra cross bracing to pull the base back. Look, now it's leaning backwards. Now we're fine. Now we're gonna add a spot for our cannon. We're gonna do this, this, and this, and then the micro door. Build it up about one third of the way. Just grab the little square, pull it up one third, slightly forward, and then connect. Done, micro door. Now you can do them differently, but this is just the basic way to do it. Okay, here we go. Now we sit and wait. This is gonna finish. We're gonna, we spent a little bit too much. Usually you can drop a cannon like right now. Um, I did a little bit of extra counter waiting here <clears throat> that I didn't need to do. So we'll sell off a piece of metal weapon. We've got enough for a cannon and we drop it down. So if we had F8, before three minutes, we've got a cannon down and we're going to give it a door. Notice I haven't done any double bracing. I haven't done anything. Save your resources other than this counterweight in the back to get the base to lean backwards. Um, now we'll connect that up there, not to the ground, to here, because this makes another node. Creating a node costs 50 metal and 400 energy. Don't make nodes. Okay, we've got this. Now we can start double bracing and cross bracing and stability tech on the inside. That's a sniper. I want to see where it's coming from. Probably right here. There, there it is. So now you know where the sniper is. Okay, now we've done the double. We've done cross bracing all through here. Don't forget to do behind your core as well. And up here and right here. Now we're going to do stability tech. Pull it up to the middle of your battery, then down. Then grab, click the node. Pull over. Okay, no, then the bracing, pull over. Then you go this one, up, down, up, down. I just find that one faster. <clears throat> there you go. Now you've got stability tech on the inside. We've got this happening. Our cannon is building. We're gonna do this now. Uh, we're gonna add in our fifth mine because we have the time. EMP, okay, that hurt. Now we need to get the right stuff in play here. Let's get our sandbag wall up here. If you don't wanna know exactly how to build it, you can watch the Firebeam tutorial video. Um, this is a quick way to do it. Firebeam tutorial video will teach you all you need to know. Cross brace all this stuff up. We're going to need another turbine. Lean backwards. Let's get a gunner. And pull these out to make squares. Our base is starting to lean forward, so we'll counterweight. Again, still not using ropes. I'm still not using ropes. Like this. Cannon. Make sure you hotkey your weapon, it's ready to fire. Make sure it's open and doors. So, I wanna shoot it right at that door. That's the rocket. Perfect, and sandbags. 
Bow, 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 bow. There we go. Notice I'm still not using ropes. I'm still not using ropes. We're going to get ourselves a sniper. There we go. And I hotkey mine. My sniper always sits on four. That's just my hotkey. I come from StarCraft. Hockey four for sniper. <clears throat> this has really started to be annoying that EMP is doing a lot of work here. But don't worry, this is going to finish up. We're going to have an architect ability here pretty soon. Now I need to do battery, battery, and one of these. And this is there's a reason for this, you guys. We're going to show you how to do a howitzer on this base build as well. Let's take out that. There we go. So I'm saving architect's ability. Now usually you want to spam it. We've talked about this a little bit. It's going to be in my other tutorial videos about spamming your abilities. I have nothing to use right now, so there's no point in doing it. I'm going to drop down another turbine. And I'm going to sit on my sniper and try and get a pick. Okay, I'm dialed in. Wait for the door. Saving resources. Door opened. Shoot. Okay, uh, now we can connect to the ground. <clears throat> We've got enough stability in here now. Um, so the reason we use these three long bracings, by the way, I never told anyone that. The reason we use these three long bracings is because the longer the bracing in forts, the stronger it is. Uh, and I'm going to shoot here. Nice shot. Okay, saving up the resources. We need 9,000 energy. It's a little bit tricky to get to, um, especially on vanilla because the wind floor for this specific build kind of sucks balls. Uh, it's not very good. Okay. Oh, nice job, Gunner. Nice job, Gunner. All right, Howitzer, look at where it's going to go. Right here. Okay. I shouldn't have done that. I wanted to open up, and I wanted to put a door in. Don't hit control. I hit control. Don't hit control. I goofed that up. So now we've got a Howitzer that's super protected. You got a spot for multiple doors here to make sure it stays protected. This is a really good spot for Howitzer, guys. You should do this in all your builds. Take that out. Now, because we got the Howie building, I use the ability. And got it almost dialed in. Listening for the door. There it is. Shoot. Okay. Now, here's a cool, another cool trick. When you start getting your base figured out, you sell off this piece of bracing. You've got your nice sandbag wall. Sixth mine right in there. Don't worry about it blinking. If you do, if you are worried, bring it down and then up. And there's enough stability tech, even if it breaks, this inner stability tech is going to hold your base up. Now, we sell off the sandbag. And we turn this stuff into background bracing. Now, most enemies will know that this is coming. And we're just going to fire this one. Oh, yeah, I got it. Yeah, I got it. Okay, we're going to go wider and up, up 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 to get another turbine got cannon ready to go easy and we should be able to win with just this notice i got my sniper on the hotkey Ooh, shotgun i want that where was that i think it was right here yeah there we go that shot now i'm waiting on my howie because i want to fire my cannon first and take out the flak that shot at the howitzer that's my goal first. So if I shoot over right, right here, take it out. Now I fire the Howie. This should connect. No, there's two gunners and a shotgun. Okay, I didn't know the AI would use the shotgun. Smart move. Take out the gunner. This is why snipers are so important, you guys. They're so important. We're not really building anything else. So at this point, this is where you decide how much more stuff you want to build. We could drop in another cannon up here. If we really wanted to. Drop in a nice little micro door. We've got the resources. Okay. I want to take out the shotgun next. There it is. And then I can fire this. That should hit. There it is. GG. So that's how you guys, that's how you do a vanilla build. Super basic, super easy. If you want to do a Howie, if you don't do a Howie, you just add more cannons uh, on top here. And uh, that's a wrap guys. So use that in your in your uh, in your builds in your maps. But notice, don't cover the bottom. Don't use ropes. Save those resources. Don't do anything. That's the key. And observe your opponent. Super short video, guys. Thank you so much for watching Synergy Gaming TV. My name is Synergy. We'll catch you guys on the flip side. Game
be touched.